Hey y'all, it's your girl Candace Lene and I'm back with another video. If you are new to this channel, please go hit the subscribe button. If you're returning, thank you and welcome back. So as you guys can see, I have another hair review for you. Um, this is another Wiggins hair review. I don't know if I mentioned last time, but um, I actually was shopping Wiggins before they started sending hair to me. So I would like to say that this is still an honest review, okay? Because I was spending my own money before they were sending me hair. So I just wanted to throw that out there. Um, but without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and jump right into the video. So starting off, you know, you gotta get into this red Wiggins bag. They gave me some lashes, uh, that is a headband, wig cap, uh, edge brush and elastic band this is their booklet hair care talks about everything or how to what you should wash with comb brush all that good stuff in there and then of course the thank you card now let's get into the razzle dazzle this is a 16 inch body wave transparent 13 by 4 unit we're not dealing with any shedding once again this wig is very very soft very nice y'all the bounce back look at the bounce back um it has combs in there and yeah right here i wanted to show you guys the lace because i knew just by looking at that that it was about to do what i wanted it to do so we're gonna use some bw2 some 30 developer to bleach these knots and you know the consistency is like toothpaste you want to get it thick enough so that it doesn't run through the lace but to actually sit on top of the knots so we're gonna speed this process up because y'all know i told y'all i got a video of this already so if you need to know how to bleach i got you boo just not in this one So if you guys can't see, I did over bleach. So right now I'm plucking, but after I'm done plucking, I'm gonna get in and show you guys how to fix over bleach units. So you wanna start off with um, a door in darkest brown, right? And you take that little spoolie and you do it very gently and go ahead and put that darkest brown color on the part that you over bleached, right? So this is gonna give you that bomb look as if you never over bleached anything, okay? There are a lot of different ways to do this, but this is the way that I do it, and it's what, it's what works for me, okay? Just try your best not to get it on the lace. Other than that, sis, you good to go. Do your thing, and yeah. And when it's all said and done, you can't even tell it was over bleached. So next we're going to go in with some edge booster. Y'all know I got a lady's edges back. Okay, let's get these together because these braids been in for a minute. They getting kind of fluffy. Go on my gosh to be and spray that down. So y'all, um, this step I'm kind of doing wrong. Like this is a step, but you want to cut your ears out first. The reason I did not is because this cap was a little small. I don't know. It was not fitting me the way it should have been fitting. So I had to spray. I had to spray the guys to be first to be able um, to keep it in the spot that I needed it in. So then you cut out your ears and then go ahead and cut off the excess cap. So I learned this trick on TikTok where you tie the back of your um, cap. That way you're not cutting off the back. You know, you still want to protect your hair. So I thought that was a good idea. So I do that now. And then just go in with my guys to be to 
um, make sure that 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 uh, what is it called? That cap isn't gonna move. Okay, we just want to make sure that cap is on there. It ain't gonna go nowhere. So that's the way that I do it. And honestly, uh, I would have put my makeup on beforehand. But I don't know, y'all. I was, I don't know what I was doing this video. But either way works. It doesn't really matter. Um, it just works a little better if you put the makeup on your cat before putting glue and stuff on it because the glue gives the the shade of makeup. It, it you can just tell that it's there. I don't know how to explain it, but like look at my cat right now. You can kind of see that the glue is there, and then I tried to put makeup on top of it. So yeah, but either way works. So y'all look at this i knew when i put this on without having any makeup on the lace that i was gonna love this week look at this look at that do you see that bruh i knew i knew it was gonna be a win so i'm just gonna cut my lace in sections because that just helps me um to apply it later but i'm gonna go ahead and apply the makeup to the lace now And then I'm going in with my um, Hold Me Down Adhesive by Erica J. If y'all haven't tried this glue yet, I don't know what you're waiting on. Like, this glue is bomb. Like, it will hold some stuff, okay? Um, I'm only going in with one thick layer because y'all know I really don't like doing glue installs. But I wanted to make sure that I made, made this wig everything that it could be. So I wanted to use real glue today. Um but one layer will do for me because i'll be taking this wig off probably within the next four days so once you get that on there you want to make sure that it's dry and then it's clear that's how you know that it's dry and then once it's once that's all set then you want to um, go ahead and push your wig into place use the comb to actually comb it in place you don't want to use your fingers for that go ahead and use the comb get it set in place and then you want to take your um elastic band and get that going on there just to make sure it's really melted look y'all it's not going anywhere it's not going anywhere next is to cut out the ear taps ear taps ear tabs okay what um I don't really know how to explain this part first I kind of like try to part it with just my finger where you could kind of see my ear and then I just kind of cut around it um it's definitely not the easiest task don't cut your ear but it can be done y'all see that lace yeah. oh my gosh okay then we're gonna go in with our razor to get rid of the excess lace y'all know the vibes y'all know the drill Like, it's so funny when I turn my head, it doesn't even look like that piece of lace is there, y'all. Like, is it just me or am I tripping? But we gonna go ahead and get rid of that last little piece of lace. And then just to make sure that it's good and it ain't gonna fly away or for whatever reason, uh, I feel like just spraying some gots to be after it's been glued, it just gives it that, mm, I can't explain it, but it gives it that, okay? So spray that and then tie it back down again, and then, you know. Y'all, sorry. I just had to take a little break and let y'all look at this lace. Like, look at this lace. I'm not even done yet. I'm not even done. Excuse me. Excuse me. Just... All right, I don't know how I want to style this. I'm not sure. I had it curled, but it's a little too long. It don't look right. Um, at this point, y'all, as y'all can hear, I'm a little congested. I'm a little sick, okay? I'm not really feeling doing my hair, so I don't know. I I, I don't know. Um, I might just leave it like this, y'all. Honestly, I don't, I don't know what to do. So, let me figure out what I'm going to do. And when we come back... 
Y'all gonna see the fire results. Guys, I totally forgot to come back and film the baby hair. Sorry, but here we are. I did the best that I could. And this is what it's doing. I don't know what to do with this up here. <laughs> so it's just here right now. But y'all, love, love, love. Y'all already know how I feel about wigging. So what more is there to say? Go get the wig. Okay, I'm going to put everything down in the description box below. You guys, make sure you check this unit out. The lace, that's, that's all you need to see right there to know that it's about to do what it needs, what you want it to do. Okay, like the lace is, it wasn't even, I don't even think that was transparent lace. I'm not sure, hold on, let me check. Oh, it is transparent. So, yeah. This is, but it's giving like HD, y'all. Like, I don't know, but it definitely blended perfect. Um, the length is what the length is supposed to be, it is full all the way to the end. So, this is 16 inches, and it's 16 inches. Um, so yeah, like I said, y'all, everything will be down below. So, make sure y'all go check this unit out. You're definitely going to get your money's worth. This is one that's a little bit more on the pricey side, but it's worth it. Like, it's definitely worth it. Um, if I were to spend, like, if I was going to buy this wig, spending my own money, like, I wouldn't been, I wouldn't have been mad about it. Y'all, I can't talk. I can't talk. But I would have not been mad about the fact that I got this after spending $150-some dollars. So... Y'all go get this, check it out. I don't know, y'all. I'm out here looking crazy. I don't, I don't know what to do with this. But um, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Be sure to ring my bell so you can be notified every time I post a new video. And I will see you guys in my next one. Peace.